France is a very beautiful country with a lot of stuff to do, a lot of nice places but I'm still moving and I'm going to explain to you why a little bit of background about me I've been living in France from 11 years old until 22, 23 so for 12 years or so I'm currently also in France and I'm 24 right now but I'm seeing my parents so that's different this is the time I graduated from masters I'm graduating this year so it's the time to find a place right and this video is about why I'm not choosing France and I'm moving away from France after 12 years of being here and this experience is from a Romanian immigrant experience the first reason is lack of deep connections I know maybe not a not everybody seeks for like deep meaningful friendships and relationships um, but as a Romanian immigrant I found, found it hard to find people like me or to find people I can like be myself with and vibe with that doesn't mean I didn't have friends I had <sighs> that's a different video topic but I did get involved in a lot of stuff and had like friends you know like high school friends college friends and all that to hang out with that to hang out with but I didn't find that they were lifetime friends yeah and that first reason may also be linked actually with the second reason which is discrimination maybe that's the reason why I couldn't like fit in necessarily um, Romanians in France uh, are seen as uh, beggars or um, gypsies or just people coming and stealing stuff and like not working and living in the streets and stuff like that like when I was in elementary and even high school when people heard where you're from like or they ask where you're from and I'm like I'm from Romania they're like backing up I lived with that my whole life I got used to it and then of course they got to know me and they saw like it's not that kind of Romanians and I was explaining them and they <laughs> giving them history classes on um, the gypsies versus real Romanians and getting getting to know me they got to know that actually not all Romanians are like that you know but I pretty much lived with it with it and I still remember in elementary school a girl asked me what was it I think it was sixth grade or even seventh grade eighth grade before high school you know uh, a girl asked me can you are you allowed to be here are you allowed are your parents allowed how how are you here you know how are you here and of course this is like children perspective but there's a lack of like sometimes information about like all that and parents are teaching their children and all that which creates discrimination or or stuff and I always felt like if I say I'm Romanian or they hear my accent they will um, kind of back off whether it's at work and in job interviews and stuff like of course it's not always the case but I felt a little tension I could I could feel it which was not the case in other countries but I could feel like the little like oh 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 okay nice you know but you could feel the tension Reason number three is Christianity. Uh, France is an atheist country and even if they do have churches and like youth groups and all that, I still felt like I didn't like get involved. Even I did get involved actually a lot, but I didn't find like we were on the same mindset about God sometimes or that I could like just share my struggles without like, maybe I didn't find the right church 
but even if I, I thought I found it, it was still like, mm, I don't I don't belong here. There was this feeling that I don't feel like I can express my faith. I can't pray in France, in French. Like I was only able to pray in English or sometimes Romanian, but in, it was always like a big challenge to pray in French with other French people, like at church and stuff. It was like, I don't want to do it and I feel like I wasn't accepted because I couldn't pray in public and like people were praying all the time in my church and yeah it was a, again a side of kind of sort of like I'm not fit to me even even in religion terms and it's it's not all atheists but I feel like it's been lonely kind of like in terms of spirituality and I didn't really grow like the the boom I had and growing my faith was in England or was when I was in Thailand or in the US like I don't know I just didn't feel it here and I base my decision based sometimes on things that are not always visible like intuition or feelings and even if I see okay there's a church there's nice people if I don't like connect somehow I can't force it and and it's hard to explain even for my parents sometimes like why do you not get involved it's like i don't like those people <laughs> i'm sorry i don't like them okay uh sometimes i'm also like selective with the people i become friends so i'm either all in or either nothing at all so in a, in high school and even college here i was not really caring to get involved with some people and we were just like classmates and stuff and i didn't I did it on purpose to stay back, backed up because I didn't feel like I want to go with them and they will not influence me in a positive way and they don't need me, they don't need my help, uh, my guidance and if people don't need me, I don't make them friends, you know. If we can both benefit from each other when, we, when you build a friendship or anything like that, if both of people can like benefit from each other somehow then it's gonna be a strong relationship or friendship but if I feel like they don't care about what I have to bring and I don't care about what they have to bring to the table in terms of friendship that's why I didn't really get involved with my classmates necessarily because I felt like their lifestyle was completely different I accepted it I appreciate it but I didn't go with them or get involved and I was also that's why people saw me as a little bit shy because I they thought like I'm shy to go with them and stuff but it's just that I don't want it it's just like if I don't want it I don't want it and it ended up being like isolation in the end because you didn't find the right people and I don't know if everybody has this concern of like finding like people who are like you but INFJs do have this concern and yeah, that was another reason. And finally, last reason is uh, jobs. It's quite hard to find a job if you don't have experience in it. Um, and again, there might be discrimination at work. And I just didn't feel like I wanted to work in France because the salaries were low, even if there's a lot of benefits, social benefit, benefits, healthcare and all that. I still feel like, no, it's, it's not something I want to do. So where am I going next? <laughs> I'm going to England. I got, I grew in my faith there. I found like people are more transparent. People don't judge you based on your career. Um, your career is literally nothing. People don't care um, about that. They mostly care about you as a person and it's easier to make like, to meet like-minded people because especially London is very international city. There's everywhere and people in conversation you'll end up talking about like, how is Switzerland and how is Norway or Canada like you're gonna meet a lot of like open open-minded people and who don't judge you and also churches are amazing and events and stuff like that and that's where I want to go for now I don't know ultimately I'll end up in a place where I'm with someone I connect with and it doesn't really matter but for now as like a young adult uh, trying to build a career it's gonna be the UK and um, I love it and I'm running out of batteries so 
hope you like this video and uh, I know it was very brief but I will come back when I'm in England with maybe more videos about studying abroad how to survive as an immigrant and stuff like that everything about being a foreigner in a country and um hope you'll follow my journey and i'll see you then Sometimes these feelings get me so misleading He turns and says, are you alright? Oh, I must be fine, cause my heart's so beating Tell me, kiss me by the riverside Sarah says it's cause she don't consider it cheating Oh, 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 o